Tonight, one family continues to keep their daughter's memory alive by gathering with loved ones to give back to an organization they say gave them so much. KSHB 41 News reporter Leslie Delaspore shares their story. 13 years ago, Dylan Watterson came into this world brightening the lives of her mom and dad. She always had like the best outlook on life and she taught us to like embrace every day and every day is a good day. But at the age of one, little Dylan was diagnosed with pulmonary hypertension, fighting for her life each and every day until tragedy struck in 2013. We were taking a trip in Seattle and she ended up getting a cold. Um, so to her, a cold was detrimental. Losing Dylan at just four years old, the Watersons went through some of their darkest days by their daughter's bedside. There's no words. Is that, I mean, you, I don't. I miss everything about her. I miss her hugs. I miss her laugh. I miss um, everything. But it was the help of loved ones and the Ronald McDonald House that gave them more than just a helping hand. We wouldn't have had anywhere to stay. We wouldn't have been close to her. We, in Seattle, <laughs> we would have not had anywhere to stay. Yeah, we don't know anybody. Now, eight years later, the Watersons family and friends continue to celebrate Dylan's life by giving back to a charity who gave them so much. We benefited from that charity when we needed them. We can still celebrate her birthday and give her gifts, but the gifts are going back to somebody else. Collecting thousands of dollars and toys over the years, the Watersons say they will continue to honor their daughter's memory by giving strength and support to those who need it most. Every day is a good day. <laughs> That's her saying. Every day is a good day, regardless of the pain or the hurt and the Whatever she was going through, every day was a good day. In Olathe, Kansas, Leslie Delasport, KSHB 41 News.